So hello you guys, welcome back to my channel. It is time for episode 5 of what has become my favourite show. This is everything. Last week's episode, in my opinion, was just one of the best episodes of TV that we have had in so long, man. I, I just, I cannot get over it. Deny knocked it out the park with the writing. Uh, but we ended on, I guess, somewhat of a cliffhanger. They drove off into the sunset, so I'm interested to see where this one picks up. Where we're at, what happens. It seems like we're both on a level playing field now. They're both of similar mindsets. So at least some of the disconnect should be put to rest. Hopefully. Although I do love a bit of angst. As always, the more extended version of this reaction is going up over on Patreon. Uh, but yeah, so the link to my Patreon is in the description down below. There's a bunch of other content that goes on up. That goes on up. That goes up on. That. Oh, Lord. Listen. I went to the carnival yesterday with my mother and my brother. And I thought. I thought at my big age of 27 that I could go <laughs> neck and neck with my brother, who is 19. Let me tell you something, if you go to a carnival with a 19 year old, don't try and keep up with them. It's not worth it, okay? My brain is still doing little twirls inside my head from some of the rides I was on. Sweet mother of God. It's actually what this wristband is from as well. We got on unlimited wristbands to go on as many rides as you want. Don't do that either. Because you're going to want to get your value for money and you're not going to be able for it. <laughs> I did win a bear though. I won him and we've called him Colin. Anyway, so Patreon. There's reactions for shows like X-Files, Angel, Handmaid's Tale, True Blood. There's film reactions. There's live streams. The extended gameplay. Telltale's The Walking Dead also goes up over there. Twitter, Instagram. Anywhere you can find me is also in the description if you want to come and say hello on other platforms. Oh, let's go with the ones who live. Those are some moist leaves. Father Gabriel! What? Oh! I... Oh! I... Oh! You alright, love? Oh my god, he's having a bit of a moment in the forest. Oh my god, I didn't... I didn't think we'd be getting fucking... Oh, uh, I didn't think we'd be getting cameos from Walking Dead cast in episode 5. I thought we'd at least have to wait for the finale for that. <laughs> well, it would make sense that it would be him, to be fair, because of the whole Jadis situation. Him and Jadis were having a... They were engaged in extracurricular activities together. Oh, we are back with our beautiful little yellow car and our love birds. Oh, she is so fucking cool. Look at her. One hand on the wheel, one hand on her man's tie. She has the situation controlled. And what the fuck is that? Treats? What? I'm wondering... Bert and Ernie? Is this what? I'm wondering why you'd cold open with Gabe, but though there's no way we'll just stumble across Gabriel out in the middle of nowhere. Never did like those. No Michonne, so. Huh? Is this a terrible gift to bring to RJ? That's an adorable No one has gift. ever once called him Junior. <clears throat> it's the thought that counts. Brave man, huh? You are. And she will remind you every day until you believe it, Rick. She's bringing the old Rick Grimes back. You might be ready for this. I think it was baking soda and spearmint. As requested. <laughs> what a throwback! And it only took him ten years, he but a couple he did it. I was in love with my son's best friend. I didn't know what to do. Oh. And you asked for that. Toothpaste. I was damned if I wasn't going to find something. Yeah, but then he ended up finding Jesus in a field and they sunk a van. It was a long you found day. You moment. Is this one? You tell me. Oh, they are so in love. It makes my insides giggle. The people from the people. It's gonna be Gabe up a fucking rock again. It cracks. I break you, stab. If it cracks, we can kill it. They get crusty like that because uh, of the steam vents. I lived in uh, Pittsburgh for a bit. <laughs> they look pretty hungry. Do you want to share our noodles with these strangers? Appreciate the help, but we're gonna need more. All of it. This is why you can't have nice things. It's nothing personal. Yeah, we can roll this back to you just saying thanks if you want. Hell no. You were given an out. It's not our fault, your assholes. You promise us to leave people be. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't believe that. Yeah, yeah, that. Oh, we're taking back our noodles. You can eat dry rocks for dinner. Really? Yeah? Yes. I was really looking forward to that. Try and commit homicide, you're going to get your noodles taken away. There would have been a time where that whole scuffle in the forest would have been so much more dramatic and intense and now we are just such boss bitches. We handle inconveniences like that like the children. Be good. No noodles for you. 
might be strange to admit it, but... He filled her glass first. That felt good. They pulled a gun on us. You don't get noodles for that. Mm -hmm. I would have had to rub salt in the wound. I would have opened the noodles and started eating them raw in front of them. Crunch, crunch, motherfucker. Ooze. What are you up to, Grimes? I'm just working with what I got. He's so sickeningly romantic. Oh my god. Oh no. Stop it. They're having some alone time. Oh. It's the fishermen from fucking hell. Oh. Th Throw back, okay? Bless this water that it may become your holy water. Is it okay? Are you okay? Even if you he just kisses her delicately on the cheek. What the fuck did you do to piss off your barber, honey? But you can't say to anyone. But I was here. He died trying to bring people together. Is she gonna tell him? The bridge. He had to destroy it to stop an incoming herd. He was caught in the explosion. And she's like, oh no, no way. What about all the people that can't forgive you? How do you live with that? Disassociating? Gaslighting yourself? Talk. Alcohol? <laughs> can't talk about the things I've been a part of. She's not even gonna tell I him will about be Rick. A part of. Oh fuck <laughs> off. Jadis. This is the second time they've been caught with their pants down. Is she wearing these boxers to bed? Oh my god. Did he just check out her ass? Rick, play some time, baby. You left breadcrumbs, ramen wrappers, all the way down Highway 90. You have an unhealthy brown. obsession, Jadis. You need a hobby. Virginia, I saved your life. You took it from him. You took it from me. You took it from our children. I needed to thank you. By dying here today, Alexandria will remain safe and your children will have a better world. She's trying to convince us I'm going to kill you, but it's a good thing. But you didn't lose. Oh, her. you fucking psychopath. You, you got me fucked up if you think I'm going to believe that shit. Your story. Oh, Gabriel comes in here and knocks her the fuck out. That's right. Smack her into the head with your sex bed. Why'd you call her his wife? Well, I mean, wasn't she? One day Rick said that I should marry them. And they're at my feet. In the dirt, right in front of me, was a ring. And I thought to put it someplace that Rick would find it. Oh God, is he going to propose to her out in this forest? That's what she's thinking. Oh, Look baby. What happened, happened. Baby, don't do it. Look, she's not into this well, proposal. sitting here and talking. Almost makes me feel like how it was. Before He's just sitting there with there. the ring in his hand, like you're kind of interrupting something here, honey. It's less about personal connection and more about responsibility. So she's giving out to Rick and Michonne saying you're going to like fuck up my whole operation mm -hmm. and they'll discover Alexandria. Mm -hmm. And yet so. here she is sneaking off to Gabe mm -hmm. time and time again. Much. That's mm -hmm. dangerous. Mm -hmm. That could compromise Alexandria. Really well, you know that I'm not even here. Take this with you. Maybe it'll give you something you need. Giving it to you is giving me something that I need. That's really Next year. sweet. So she got engaged and they're not going to see each other for another year. I told you she left a file about home for the CRM to find. Destroy Alexandria. Yeah, but if we kill her, then we're fucked. Just like run her off the road a little bit and zip tie her to a tree somewhere. We can talk to her. Oh, fuck. Hello. Good God damn. You look like a pile of hippo shit, sister. Seen much hippo shit, have you? What? It's tall. <laughs> the bases are spread out across the country. All right. Hit it You're tall. You take her alive, oh my god, thank you. Okay, we'll help you. This feels like a trap. Why is there so many sheets? It's like a maze of laundry. Yeah, it's, it is. Is that what this is? Are we guiding them a particular way? Is there somebody behind him there? Oh. All we have to do is lure you in here. Like you. I think they're gonna have to kill you this time. I don't think we can let you live a second time. Oh, well. Karma! Attack me once, shame on you. Attack me twice, Walker eats your fucking throat out. It is what it is. And if I can, I'm not here. No. Stop talking in riddles, woman. You are. Can I confide in you? It's like I haven't I gotten laid in days. a long time. I have you. And that proves that you're still here, Ed. Just does. I think he's the only person that we've seen her have a soft spot for. Why don't you come with me back to Alexandria? I'm sorry for turning you into a loose end. What? The fuck? She doesn't kill Gabriel, does she? Break all my bones one by one till I well, where I have my file on Alexandria. 
And Gabriel, shut up, Jadis. Gabriel's at the end of The Walking Dead, right? And then we saw him, we saw him at the end. But this, this isn't the future. This is after The Walking Dead, even though it was a jump back in time. Oh, God. Well, Jadis, you're in pretty bad shape. You're going to need us to help you anyway. So I don't know why you're hiding. It didn't have to be this way. It didn't, but you made it this way, so there you go. You don't really want to kill everyone back home, and I've chosen my light. So who's gonna die today? Probably you, Jadis. I'm not feeling good about this situation. Why put Gabriel into this equation now, unless he's gonna pop out of the woodwork? Maybe he's gonna jump out of nowhere, swinging the machete. She's right. Rick. She's right? Still a deal to be made. You say I was injured in the crash, the lone survivor. For a second time, Rick, how many times can you be the lone survivor of a situation before people start to go, hey, something about him? Michelle gets away, and I never tell them about Alexandria. Why should I trust you? Well, if you don't, you'll die anyway. the shit that you've pulled. We got a deal. All right, but this still doesn't feel right. No, not your bag of noodles. Don't go too close to her, though. I don't trust her. You know she's got the fucking hots for you, like, and you're in a room you full of nothing but bed sheets. Lay down yours. She's got way too many pockets on that outfit. She could have grenades, knives, fucking bits of sticks shoved down into her boot. I'd just proceed with caution. Where'd Michonne go? You've looked better. <laughs> Ouch. That is the second time he has dragged her for filth on this show, and I'm kind of living for it. We knew that you'd double cross us. I don't trust you either. Shoot me. Make me understand. Show me who you are. Drop it. Michonne knew. I double crossed you. Yep, she knew there was fuckery afoot. Ah, oh, fuck, that's it for Jadis. A oh, bad day for you, sweetie boy. I don't think she'll be making it to this year's meeting. I'll see you next year, Ed. He must be down bad for her. She just tried to kill him, and he's like, anyway, see you next year, love. It's in my room. The CRM will bring the world back. The CRM is not the answer. And they must end. We're gonna do that. This looks like news to Rick. I wish I died an artist. Yeah, but it's never does. about survival. She's just butt naked out in that the... life. Junkyard. Oh my this God. is mine. My peace. Ah, oh, she's still wearing the ring. She's gonna be like, tell Gabriel my answer is yes, I'll marry him. But he's gonna have to get here pretty fucking fast. You told Gabriel you wanted to marry her. Do what you said you would do. We're gonna propose Please. in front of a dying Jadis. Even Michelle's like, fuck that. That would be a suck ass proposing. Do not propose to me in this room of blankets with our enemy bleeding out on the fucking floor. I cannot believe that is just the end of Jadis. She has had such a huge arc on, uh, in the Walking Dead universe. I mean, she spanned what three shows? She jumped from from like the Walking Dead to World Beyond to this, just to die Don't by a walker. I feel like no one dies by walkers anymore. You have to be really fucking stupid to live this long and be killed by a walker. I've been wanting to say something. It's a broken world, and you're the only thing. Oh. Till my last breath, I am yours. I thought they were already married, but okay. But it's only ever been you. I'm yours. Oh, fucking hell. Oh, that's horrible. He's gonna turn up and Jade this isn't gonna fucking be here. Ah, the, the mascara I'm wearing isn't waterproof and starting to burn my fucking eyes. Oh, oh, Gabe. If I could see you, I'd feel really bad for you right now. Oh my god, that proposal. Oh, they are not playing with them as a couple, are they? They are giving us, like, absolute fucking roundhouse kick to the heart, episode by episode. This one was... Oh, I can't wait to do the discussion on this. This was a big one. But, like, having a proposal out in the middle of the forest and what he said to her and her getting down to his level. Oh my god, seriously, my eyes are burning. Like, my eyes teared up and then the mascara has, like, reacted with my eyeballs and it's not happy. I can't help but feel bad for Gabriel. He's just sitting there with his little box of hopes waiting for her. <laughs> oh, that's it for this week, you guys. Thank you so much for watching. Uh, like I said at the beginning, the link to my Patreon is in the description down below where the extended version of this reaction is going to be going. 
um, Twitter, Instagram, anywhere you can find me is down below. I'll be doing a discussion video on this in the upcoming days and I can't wait to talk about it. This show has gone from strength to strength with every single episode. It just gets better and I cannot believe next week is the last episode. I really, really, really do hope that we get a season two. I feel like it is a missed opportunity and a fumbled um, show if they don't. Now, I understand it was supposed to be a miniseries, self-contained Mini series was the name put on it, right? It was never said that it was a one season, that it was a strict one season event. I know with World Beyond, they said that it was um, a two season event. Everyone knew going into World Beyond, there was two seasons and that's it. I don't think they specified with this, so fingers crossed that maybe next week after the finale that we might get news, they might announce, hey, guess what? There's a season two and I'm going to vomit blood from excitement in the corner. It is what it is. Yeah, but thank you guys so much for watching and I will talk to you all soon.